I'm here. Thanks for visiting my channel. If you can like, subscribe. Basically, it's a channel, I was going to say dedicated to One Wheel, but it's not. One Wheel are the videos I'm sharing at the moment, just because I've just got one. And I've got video cameras and stuff, so it just seemed like an idea to film me doing One Wheel stuff. Um, but I am an actual videographer. I do weddings, uh, music videos, promo videos, real estate, all that sort of thing. So that's what I do full time. But yeah, I just figured some of you might enjoy watching me doing some one wheel stuff. Um, I'm gonna try and hook up with some local one wheelers. I guess they're called one wheelers. And make some decent content. You know, we've got drones, video cameras, GoPros, all that sort of thing, so. Which brings me onto the point of this video, which is the GoPro Hero 7. It's not really a comparison uh, to the GoPro 8, but it kind of loosely is. Basically, when I got my one wheel, I thought, oh, I need to get a GoPro. For some reason, I've, I've never actually got a GoPro, even though I've been a videographer for five, six years now. I don't know why. I just never really felt the need for one until, until I got my one wheel, and then I thought, yeah, I need one. I did a bit of uh, researching online, and obviously the GoPro Hero 8 is out now. So I just, uh, obviously there's, there's a bit of difference in price, and I just wanted to see what the main differences between the 7 and 8 were. I was quite surprised to find out that the, the GoPro Hero 8 doesn't have a changeable lens cover which was quite a big one for me because you know I'm going to be taking it out on the one wheel and I'm guessing it's going to get scratched at some point or I at least want the option to be able to replace it and you don't seem to be able to do that on the GoPro Hero 8 uh, for some reason I'm not sure why and when I looked at some of the comparison videos in terms of image quality the the GoPro Hero 8 just seemed to be quite overly saturated. I could be wrong, you know. I, I haven't I haven't seen it firsthand, so I can't really make too many comments on the GoPro Hero 8. Uh, it's not really fair, is it? I mean, the image stabilization on the 7 is, is great anyway. Um, so for me, the new features in themselves weren't enough to sell it to me. So I opted for the 7 and it's just arrived today. Here is the GoPro Hero 7 Black. Nice. Um, I mean, I don't really need to go into what a GoPro does, I don't think so. The one thing I do want to get into is the amount of stuff that came with it. Um, I got this bundle off of SLR Hut, uh, link in description. But the amount of stuff that came in this box is just nuts. I mean, got, got a monopod. And it's, you know, it's fairly decent quality. It's quite, it seems quite durable. It's long, and um, way long enough for what I needed. So I've got one of those in its little bag. Got a case with it. And um, it's got those where you have to take out the things to make a gas for the things. So that's good. Got one of those. Got a handlebar seat post clamp thing. Um, I can't imagine that I'll ever be making GoPro videos just riding my bike. Um, I know some people do, but that's not really my thing, so I guess it's cool to have. Cable thing. Head strap thing. Again, I can't imagine that I'll be walking around with it just strapped randomly to my head, but if I did want to, I have the option. Chest strap thing. Again, I'm not sure if I'd ever use that, but Possibly, mm, maybe. Possibly you could use it with a one wheel at some point. Uh, chest, I'm not sure. Probably not, but. Floaty thing for the water. Now another little gorilla type tripod thing. It's quite handy. Loads of little mounts. Oh, it's coming handy, won't they? Uh, little battery bag, I think that is. That's quite handy as well. In the um, this is just a hook. No idea what it's for, what it does, or what I could possibly use it for, but who knows? Maybe one day it'll come in handy. So I've got one of those. 
helmet mount kit. Now that is something that I will be using. That's all I really needed, but I'm glad I got all this other stuff. Uh, waterproof housing. That might come in handy. Uh, I might be doing some weightboarding or um, kite surf videos at some point. Not that I can actually really kite surf yet. That's my next, uh, the next thing on my list of things to do. Spare battery, always a, always a good one. Speedy card reader, if it works, great. Speedy card reader, might use it. And a cloth, I can never have too many of those. But yeah, all that stuff from SLR Hut. If you want like a GoPro and you want anything you can possibly think of, then get that. Although, the one thing I did need, it didn't actually come with it, which is an attachment for the GoPro for a, for a monopod. So that's a bit annoying, but hey ho, can't win them all. So yeah, now I've got my GoPro. Let's go and get some footage. I'll take it with me on my one wheel. Let's go. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, please like, subscribe, do the bell thing. I really want to try and create a bit of a community here. I'd uh, love to check out your videos, so leave a comment. Let me know who you are. You know, that's what YouTube's all about, isn't it? It's just, um, isn't it? I don't know. Maybe it is. I don't know, I'm quite new to it, so I think that's what it's all about anyway. So like, subscribe, do the thing, and uh, I'll see you next time. I haven't got a catchphrase, so maybe that is my catchphrase. I'll see you next time. Uh, that's it for now. I'll see you next time.